remembered that Ned Smith is probably one of our foremost wildlife painters and he was able to secure the backing of the Pennsylvania Game News and many of his drawings graced the cover of the Pennsylvania Game News. Mm. And uh, of course he was responsible or was my inspiration for the love of the whitetail, the Pennsylvania whitetail, which I uh, do a lot of work in. And uh, he captured the, the whitetail buck so ex exquisitely. And uh, my feeble attempts are in three dimension, where his were uh, as paintings as such. But he's gone now, and we'll miss his work. This particular piece here, hunters tell me, is the one shot that they see most of all. <laughs> and that's that white flag getting away from them, leaving them fast. And so it's entitled hindsight. And that's all you see is the hind. <laughs> You might say the hind of the hind, because in the Bible, the hind is a deer, you see. That's what, in scripture, that's what they called a deer, was a hind. Okay. I don't think it has anything to do with the back end of it, but uh, that is, uh, it's kind of a play on words, you might say. And these other ones here are just different studies of the buck, some of them eight, ten, or more points on the deer. And prior to Pennsylvania, I, I chose that title because the whitetail is the pride of Pennsylvania to uh, hunters, and hunters come from all over the United States to hunt in Pennsylvania. You always have a, a very fine selection of, uh, of whitetail. Carving an ant, you can't really go wrong because no two are alike. They're like fingerprints.